Hello Scorpios, it's Lori. I'm here to do your daily reading. We're going to roll the Zodiac die. Got some strong Libra, Capricorn, Pisces, Aquarius, Taurus, and Gemini. Energy there. You guys know the routine. May or may not be your reading, general reading. Personal readings can be had by emailing me at the address in the description box below. Asking for more information is not a commitment to having a reading done, so do not feel obligated once you receive the information. Okay, let's go ahead and cut the deck, and we'll get your reading going. Yay! Full energy, the tower, two of swords, the lovers, that's three major arcana, four major arcana out of five cards. Page of cups, oh, justice, by the way. Page of cups, and then seven of cups, temperance, five out of <laughs> seven of swords, and you are coming out of a uh, the energy of strength, of compassion, of um, protection and wanting to move forward take a leap of faith move on from whatever it is that you are in that has kept you feeling like you just have to be in control okay that's what that strength card was trying to tell me in my other reading control okay we have the tower over the two of swords here. And it could pertain to the lovers and some sort of justice between you guys. How oh, the page of cups, there's an apology going to be had that's going to restore some sort of balance here. There has been some sort of um, player energy I'm getting. Somebody was... being a little sneaky, a little deceptive, maybe playing, um, burning both ends of the candle. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. What's going on here, my Scorpios? Let's go ahead and get some clarification here. What's this tower energy all about? Clarification of the Tower Energy for the Scorpio Daily Reading, please. The Lovers. Look at this. We have the Lovers and the Lovers. And then we have these three cards that came out. Four of Swords, Wheel of Fortune, and the Ace of Pentacles. And this is clarifying the Tower I'm hearing that you need to take a major break from this relationship. That you really want to step back from this, reassess the whole situation, work on turning luck in your favor again, and having a fresh start. There's been a big major, major tower event here. Something happened between you and your person. Okay, let's go ahead and get clarification of the Two of Swords. The Ace of Wands. Two of Swords suggests that you've kept the blinders on about something pertaining to the heart. Something that you're passionate about. You are the Queen of Cups. Yeah, somebody's somebody has been playing the field. Or at least they are saying and suggesting that they are. And I'm not saying it's you, Scorpio. It could be your person. It could be someone else around you entirely. I was asking for um, clarification of the lovers in my head. And we got the Two of Pentacles. Now, the Lovers talks about choices, about balance, about duality, okay? So, we have here almost even. This Pentacle is just a little bit higher, okay? So, you're still waiting for that ship to come in to settle this dispute. 
you're waiting for the seas to calm. Somebody's been doing too much partying. And they're married. Okay. Let's clarify the justice card here. Six of Pentacles. Queen of Pentacles and the Chariot. Ooh. This Queen of Pentacles is ready to move on. And this could be your energy, Scorpio. That's all I'm seeing out here right now. You're the fool. You're looking for a change. <clears throat> you're not a fool. Scorpio, I'm not calling you a fool. I'm saying that you're the fool energy here. Okay? You're ready for a fresh new start. You're tired of the same old, same old. Trying to balance things all the time. Always being the one to give. Because there's one person who always receives a little bit more here in this. And then you're left out in the cold. Okay. Yep, you're deciding to move forward. You want justice in this situation. And once you get it, you're out of there. That's what I'm hearing. All right, let's clarify the Page of Cups. What's this Page of Cups energy here for the Scorpio Collective, please? Nine of Wands. So this is about feeling like the wounded warrior, having your walls up, um, feeling defeated, deflated, hurt, and tired. And you know you've got only one more battle in you before you're just so done. Okay? So I'm hearing if I don't get this apology, even if I get this apology, I'm not sure I'm going to accept it. I want to feel whole again. I want to feel happy again. I want to drink from all these different wonderful aspects of life. You want a dream come true. And you want it with somebody who gives you as much as you give them. Okay, let's go ahead and clarify the Seven of Cups here, please. Can we get clarification of the Seven of Cups? <sighs> clarification of the Seven of Cups, please. They don't want to turn over. The Magician and the Knight of Cups. Somebody's been playing with your emotions. Okay? They're leaving you confused. Not sure what to do. Not sure what direction to go. They come in one moment um, hot and heavy. But you really get the sense that they're, they're just toying with you. That they're controlling you. That's what I'm getting from this. That they always win. Let's go ahead and get clarification of the temperance card here, please. Can I get clarification of the temperance card, please, for the Scorpio daily reading? Nine of Swords, Sleepless Nights, Dissatisfaction, Ready to Move On, Stand Your Ground and Own Your Life, Be in Control, and, and just have absolute clarity, the truth. Okay? Yeah, you're tired of the way things are. You're tired of the sleepless nights. You're tired of the dissatisfaction. You're ready to move on. You've got everything you need within you. Um, you are the Emperor. Okay? That's awesome energy right there. And you're going to speak your truth. You are going to speak your truth. You're going to end those sleepless nights. You're going to have, you're going to achieve your goals. Okay? You're going to have a happy home, happy life. Or, I'm hearing, you're going to have nothing at all. Okay? <sighs> Clarification of the Seven of Swords here, please. Oh, I forgot to get your outcome cards. Hold to that in a minute. Clarification of the Seven of Swords, please. Yep, you're going to take yourself out of the situation. You are going to take yourself away from this. You are really going to look at your life. You are not going to be stuck defending yourself. Um, 
you're not going to take part in this deceptive behavior, this in and out attitude that you're getting. You're going to go within. You're going to assess your life. You are going to heal. Yeah. You're going to have, you want a fresh new start. You want to be healed. You're, you're done with this. Okay. Hopefully uh, these energies are going to change and things are going to start being happier on the daily because this has not been happy. Okay. We've got Ten of Pentacles, King of Cups, and Five of Wands as an outcome or what you don't see coming. Ten of Pentacles is awesome. Somebody's really going to stand in their emotions here. Okay. With the Five of Wands, I do feel like um, you're tired of the competition. Tired of always striving and trying to win this King of Cups affection. Okay? So you're going to stand in your own emotions. You're going to take control of your emotions and work towards your Ten of Pentacles. Your happiness. Your future. Your stability. No, no, no. <laughs> okay, magical map shifter fell on the floor. Let's see what that says. Spirit orchestrates everyone's destiny. Hmm. And we have seven here. This is talking about um, the divine. So what I'm hearing is, is that Whatever strength you're feeling right now is coming from divine protection for your own good. You are seeing the truth of the matter. You're willing to move on from where you're at um, because you are being guided to wake up, to take stock, to assess your life. Talisman 49. A, le a lesson truly learned is crystallized as earned wisdom. You have all you need for the success you seek. Absolutely. You have everything that you need. Everything is within you. 22. Set your intentions and move forward. Okay? Be clear about what it is you want in life. Do this full assessment. Think about it seriously when you're in... You're wise. You know. Okay? Spirit of place. <clears throat> Authenticity is the essence of power. So standing in your truth. Your, you've got this. Okay? Being true to yourself. That, speaking your truth. Okay? This is all part of it. Um, yeah. You've got this, Scorpio. I'm sorry to do this, but i got to go. Much love, peace, and happiness. Bye-bye.